And then here's one of the most amazing things in the world that comes at least in part through a domato. You've got to get it through a proper teacher. He has the ability, half the times not knowing it himself, to set in order the proverbs or the wisdoms that he gives to you. Look this way. What in the world does that mean? Not only do you guys over there and all of us need to know and I need to know God's will for our lives. Do you know something that's just as important as God's will? Is God's timings. My times are in thy hands. Many a person God has spoken to as a younger person and said, I want you to do this, this, and this. And sometimes they were foolish enough to go out and try it all immediately. And God was giving them a vision of what he would do for them 20 years down the road. I want you to obey God, but it's not enough to hear from heaven. You've got to also know God's timings in your life. And Solomon says one of the things that a domata has the ability to do, no thanks to him, half the time he doesn't need it, but he dispenses such wisdom that you start to get to the place where you can rely not only in God's Word, but the moving of the Spirit, so you not only know what to do, you know when to do it. That's a marvelous plus that comes through the teaching of a domata. Now, I just said a mouthful there. I hope you got that. The, the wisdom of God, the guidance of God. You need it in this stupid old world. We live in a world that's nuts. You need God's timings in your life. He sets in order. Do you want to know God's will? Wave at me for your life. Do you want to know God's timings for God's will for your life? Wave at me. God doesn't expect you to fly off the handle at something. He, he will do it. Get to know him. Get to know him. Like my daddy used to play on the accordion. Getting to know you. Getting to know God. Getting to know God. It's all part of a domata's gift in your life. And most people haven't met a domata. Think of it. Most of the church is starving. How do you know that? <laughs> Jesus said it. He said, when I come, he said, will I find faith on this earth? Not the Protestant faith or the Catholic faith, but find real trust based on explaining of my word. He said, no. Wow. 